Tere, minu nimi on Lisanna ja ma tulen Eestist. After finishing my bachelor studies in Estonia, I came to study in Sweden because I wanted to continue my studies in English and also get more international experience. The environmental chemistry program at Örebro University is in English and our teachers and professors come from all over the world. The master program is built up to follow one course at a time with examination at the end of the course, which gives the possibility to focus fully on one subject. Most of the courses split up to focus on specific topics, which are explained in the lectures and then used in the practical labs and case studies. In the program we use problem-based learning, where we discuss our problems and results together or share ideas to help each other. Problem-based learning has been a great addition to our lectures, where we have been solving some cases, brainstorm ideas how to solve problems and later presented our ideas to our professors. The program schedule gives us a fair amount of free time, which we have been using for studying together as well. I believe that working in a team has helped us to succeed together. I like how close we have gotten with our classmates, but also with our teachers and professors during the learning process. In my thesis work, I'm part of a research project where we study mothers and children from China and Scandinavia and their differences related to their environmental exposure. This project has given me the opportunity to do part of my thesis work in Beijing, which I'm very grateful for. Seeing how other cultures work has given me an amazing experience I will never forget. In addition to classroom-based learning at the university, the program also includes field trips, where we go to gather samples for later analysis in the lab. This teaches us the procedure and gives us hands-on experience. Environmental samples are not the only ones we investigate in our labs. We also look at samples from humans, like blood and urine. One part of the research lab is interested in human exposure to environmental pollutants from different sources. Practical experience in the lab gives us much needed knowledge and skills for the future. The labs are usually run with the help of our teachers and laboratory technicians, but we also get independent tasks. I'm so glad to be able to learn so much about our instruments in the labs. This is something I was lacking on previously, but it's very important for the future jobs, or if you want to continue our studies in PhD. Besides studying, I had the opportunity to work as a laboratory technician during summertime and do some additional paid work in the lab during the semesters. The data from my summer work was also published in a scientific paper where I had the honor to be a co-author for the first time. Before coming to Örebro University, I wasn't sure what my possibilities after graduating with a master's degree were. After studying here for two years, I've gotten so much experience and learned so many things. For example, I could stay in the research or start working in the industry. Studying in Sweden has opened my eyes more than I thought it would, and I'm excited about the future.